Hey y'all, I'm Fran with the developer relations team here at WP Engine focused on headless WordPress. And in today's quick short video, I'm gonna talk about telemetry and its importance in understanding our users for Faust.js, the headless WordPress framework. To recap, when we launched Faust.js at the end of 2022, we included a feature for basic telemetry to help us understand how users are using the WordPress plugin and JavaScript framework. That telemetry is tied to WP Engine's corporate Google accounts using Google Analytics and is strictly opt-in only to ensure absolutely no data at all is sent without your consent. Today, I'd like to ask you all to help us plan for the future of Faust.js by opting into our telemetry collection. It collects no identifying information about you or your site directly but it does help us understand what you were using, which we can then use to help build better features and integrations for Faust.js in the future. What do we want to know? Well, we're hoping to understand things like if you're using like advanced custom fields or pods.io, or what is the most popular SEO plugin among Faust.js users. Even simple things like if Faust is being used on more multi-site instances, and how many builds are being handled with Faust.js just aren't something we have much visibility into at the moment. Over the next year, we have a dual focus on the Faust.js team to improve the developer experience of headless WordPress and to make it easier to personalize your content delivery. While we understand that it is more difficult to develop headless WordPress sites than traditional WordPress sites, quantifying what exactly that means is compl a completely different story. With your help, we want to anonymously see where the pain points are so we can make Faust.js the best headless framework for all our users. Now, with all that being said, let's jump into WP Admin, download the Faust plugin, and see what that looks like to opt in. I'm in my WP Admin page at the Add New Plugins page here, and I'm gonna type in Faust, and it should populate once I search for it. There it is. I've already downloaded the plugin. So when I go to my installed plugins page on the left hand side, you can see here that there is a banner that pops up that says, to help the Faust.js team make decisions on where to focus our efforts for you, we would like to collect anonymous information on how you are using the plugin's features. You can read more on what we collect by reading Faust telemetry. You simply have to opt in with the yes button. And once you click that in, you're all set. And it says your telemetry decision has been made. Super stoked. Now I can help make Faust.js a better framework with the data of how I use it. But you might be asking, hey Fran, what if we don't want to stay in telemetry and want to opt out one day? Well, I've got news for you, you can. On the left hand side of the hamburger menu, go under settings, and when you hover it over it, it populates the Faust option here. Click on that, scroll down to features, and then there's a checkbox, the last one here that says enable anonymous telemetry. You can leave that checked or unchecked as you please and opt in and out. Stoked again. Now that concludes the video. And if you have any questions for us and the Faust team, please hit us up in our Discord channel or in the Faust.js repository. I'll leave the links you need in the video description and documentation. And until then, y'all, happy coding.